Never wait for hot water again with a tankless water heater from Plumbing Experts. Tankless water heaters are easy, convenient, and now more affordable with a no interest financing for up to 18 months. Stop with the cold showers and wasted water and call Plumbing Experts today. It's the Weather Extreme video. This is the afternoon edition. This is for Friday, the 17th of January. I'm James Spann. A cold front comes in here tomorrow with a good chance of showers during the day. Then much colder air blows in here by Sunday and early next week. Let's discuss things. Here's the upper air look across the country this afternoon. Big trough developing in the western states, producing some nasty icing and winter weather conditions for parts of the Midwest. But really not bad today. Quite frankly, we didn't expect to see this much sun. Nobody's griping. With that sunshine, we've got temperatures in the 60s. Look at Tuscaloosa soaring to 69. But on the other hand, you've got Fort Payne at 52, a wedge of colder air affecting the northern and eastern part of the state. And again, we're watching very cold air over the northern states. Some of that's going to break away. We'll start to feel that on Sunday. Blizzard warnings in effect for parts of Minnesota, the Dakotas, and Iowa. Winter storm warnings in effect for the same region. Winter weather advisories all the way from Missouri up into parts of the northeast United States. But down here, things are quiet. Severe weather through tonight. No severe storms expected. Maybe some thunder west of the state. Then tomorrow, a cold front comes in. Nothing like the deal last Saturday. There could be some thunder in spots, but just nothing more than showers and probably light rain amounts with this feature. Here's the rain for the next seven days. Heaviest rain west of the state. This is valid through Friday morning of next week. Amounts around here under one half inch for most spots. A chance to dry out. So model fans, let's roll it. Here's the GFS, the 12Z run, valid tomorrow at 3. Troughing to the north, the cold front coming through. Got a deep surface low that's over Michigan. Snow coming into the northeast United States. And for us, we'll catch the trailing front. You can see the high-res NAM at noon showing showers at that point over the, about the northern half of the state. A decent chunk of the morning should be dry here in places like Birmingham, Tuscaloosa, Anniston, Gadsden. Uh, showers coming in here by afternoon. And then by 6 o'clock, showers kind of winding down. And again, with no instability and very weak dynamics, no severe weather, probably no thunder. And I'd say we see, we'll see a high in the low 60s. This is Sunday. The sky becomes bright and sunny, nothing but sunshine, but colder. The high between 45 and 48 with a good northwest wind of 15 to 25. Monday, we start the day in the low to mid-20s, way below freezing. The sky will be sunny. A high Monday will be in the 40 to 45 degree range. And Tuesday, again, will be way below freezing. Lows around 20. Highs in the low to mid-40s. Bright sunshine. Here are the anomalies for Tuesday. We're deep in the green. That's temperatures in excess of 10 degrees below average down through here. Wednesday, once again, we start the day below freezing, but we start to warm up in the afternoon. The high should be in the low 50s. Thursday, we're dry, but a storm system west of the state. And then a week from today, Friday the 24th, troughing to the west, a deep surface low near St. Louis. Snow north of that feature, rain moving in here. And there's no instability. The bottom line is the, the air is too uh, cold for severe weather and too warm for snow or ice. Just rain at the end of next week on Friday. Let's go out uh, 10 days to Monday, the 27th of January. A little weak trough to the west, but the air dry. Things look quiet and seasonal at that point. Rain for Birmingham off the European Ensemble. The mean about two inches between now and early February. And the numbers off the National Blend of Models. You can see the coldest air coming in here Sunday, Monday, Tuesday. Then we start to warm back up with highs back in the 50s toward the end of next week. Uh, but again, this cold pop coming in uh, Monday, Tuesday, certainly not long lasting. And typically that's the case down here at this low latitude. We'll check the AO, Arctic Oscillation, coming off the European Ensemble. We're watching the green. That's the mean of the ensemble members. And the green and the control both stay positive. And you really want to see that going negative and the NAO going negative for a big, major uh, you know, longer lasting cold snap here. We don't see that at this point. That's it for the Weather Extreme video this afternoon. Well, I've notes in the blog. My next video here Monday morning at 7 o'clock. If you can't catch us this evening on ABC 3340 News at 4, 5, 6, and 10 o'clock. Thanks for watching. Have a great weekend and God bless. AS Heating and Air, the team ensuring your comfort.